hi dhwani hi prasha uh, so very congratulations for both of you to uh, you know for converting the flame interview round and securing the admission prasha can you tell us something about yourself hi so i'm prasha watwani and i'm uh, studying in jasadbhan ml school i am currently in humanities and my subjects are english language literature mass media economics sociology psychology my favorite subject is probably mass media and communication um i've always been interested in it and you know it's just it's all mass media is always everywhere around us so um i'm also a dancer uh, i've been doing ballet jazz contemporary and gymnastics since around like 5 to 6 years now um and it's one of my uh, really greatest passions so yeah that's just something about me uh dwani could you uh, also you know introduce yourself yeah um hi i'm dwani shah i'm currently studying in jamna bai nursery school the ic section and i've taken up commerce so my subjects are math account commerce economics um i apart from that i really like playing football so i'm a part of the school football team for like 5 6 years now and yeah great so both of you have a diverse background one like football one like dancing okay so uh Uh, dwani could you uh, let us know how did you got to know about the consulting services that ims uh, provide to the students yeah so uh, one of my friends is applying for ashoka and she is also um, uh, taking class from ims so she told me that uh, you know she had a mock interview with you all and she said it was really helpful so she told me that i can uh, contact the person and get a mock okay uh so uh, did you had any kind of expectation uh, when you first approach the counselor um i knew that they would like prepare me and ask me a few general knowledge questions which could help me so yeah okay uh, tisha did you had any kind of expectation or you know any mindset before you approach the counselor and uh, did did you know did the counselor uh, stood up to your expectation Yeah so I attended a Zoom session with Miss uh, Sanika and she uh, really like gave us a brief about all the you know liberal um, arts universities and everything that you need to do like for the application process this was around like a few months back and then I applied for the Google form and then um, she started counseling me and helping me with the whole process and yeah she um, it was really good like I understood more, and I asked her more questions about how to go about it, and I understood like what are the different aspects of the application and the admission process, and what like details I need, and yeah, so it was pretty good. So you attended one-to-one counseling session with Sanika, or you attended uh, the group counseling? I attended one-to-one counseling session. Okay, and uh, how about you, Dwani? Yeah, even I had a one-to-one counseling session. I'm not sure of the name, but it was some um, um, so. Okay. Right. Uh, did the counselor, you know, uh, offer you the help with respect to your application, your SOPs and essays, and the you know, uh, helping you with the interviews? Yeah. So. Um... she really helped me with my essays like she helped me edit my essays and what questions will be coming in the interview so we took a mock interview um we had around 2 3 mock interviews and it really like prepared me because at first i was really nervous but then later um i realized like you know it's really uh, easy and she really like helped me go through it and we even did like a mock interview with another uh, mentor from ims and it felt real so it was uh, a great push and it made me like feel more confident and easy going going into the interview itself uh so what? i contact yeah i contacted the person after i was done with my sops and everything but i did get help for the mock interview so i had a mock interview with the uh, mentor or uh, the day before my uh, actual interview and it really helped cuz they prepared me for what kind of questions that they would normally ask and they um, made me feel like more at ease so yeah uh could you also uh, give a brief about uh, how your actual interview uh, went dwani 
Yeah, so uh, they read my SOP first and then they asked me why I wanted to join Flame and what was it about liberal studies that really uh, interested me and um, they had asked me a few general knowledge questions and I was able to answer a few of them and I wasn't able to answer a few of them but luckily they had asked me a question which I was also asked the previous day in the mock interview so that really helped. Okay. Uh... Prisha, was your actual interview uh, on the similar line that with the mock interviews? Yeah, definitely. Uh, they asked me about, you know, why I chose Flames and what I'm interested in after reading my SOP. And they asked me, like, about mass media because I said I was really interested about that. So they prepared, um, the mock interviews really prepared me because they also asked me, like, similar questions. So it felt like it was just another mock interview and it felt like I was just at ease. So. I mean, we tell students that, you know, take as many mock interviews as you can so that your actual interview, you know, you can treat that as a next mock interview. Okay. Uh, was Sanika ma'am available for, you know, on WhatsApp whenever you needed help? Was she available? Yeah, she was always available and she always helped all of us with the interviews and the SOPs and we would always like, consult her. If, I would consult her if I had a question or any query in that area. Uh, I would like to, you know, uh, ask you one interesting question, like, uh, so on a scale of, let's say, 0 to 10, okay, uh, I am sure you put an, you, you put the effort to apply to various institutes and the counsellor that is Sanika ma'am also helped you with, right? So, uh, on a scale of 0 to 10, uh, how would you rate uh, the effort put in by Sanika ma'am to uh, help you convert uh, this call? Uh, I would give it a 10 on 10 because she really helped me with everything and like it paid off, like the results really paid off and yeah, it was a really helpful process. She helped us with almost with everything basically. Um, and we also got, I also got to know the other people that were applying as well to Flame and Ashoka because we had the mock interview. So I got to know them as well and yeah. How about you Dwani? Yeah, so I was contacting uh, Raksha ma'am, but she was there, she gave me help 24-7 and even uh, after the interview, she asked me how it was for feedback and everything and yeah, even I would rate it a 10 out of 10 because it really helped me prepare and everything. Okay, uh, before we wrap up, what advice would you give to your friends who would be applying to Flame and other university this year or to your junior who will be applying next year? Um, I would say to uh, to, mo to watch a few interviews online and to not be very nervous and think and take your time before you answer. How about you, Prisha? Yeah, definitely. Just be yourself going into the interview and know what you're saying. Um, maybe like practice sample papers for the entrance exam online. And yeah, just relax and be yourself because uh, it's it will really like calm you before so your nerves don't get to you. Great. Once again, congratulations and all the best for, you know, the upcoming interview rounds that you had with the other universities. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you.